Hello, in this video I'm gonna show you Tupolino locks for Vans and how to operate with it. This is how the decoder looks like. It comes with a plastic box, reset cap, this safely allows you to reset the pins, tension, reset tool, obviously the tool. Here on the back, with the help of the reset tool, you will open the cap and you will find eight spare pins in a small plastic plastic bag. Now, why this tool is great is because it has independently sliding pins. It's not foil, so the moment it opens, it keeps the coat. You can reuse it if the pins are not resetted. The main thing you should remember is that this button is here for a reason. Whenever you slide it up and down, uh, up and down, you can see a small metal thing going through the pins. This is what protects the pins whenever you insert and whenever you extract. So, whenever you reset, the pins, uh, the slider should be pushed, slided back towards the blade handle. You'll see an arrow here, an arrow here. You simply insert, you can clearly see the pins through the holes and you reset it. Whenever you are about to insert it, the button is slided up towards the blade and this is uh, when you insert it. This is the only thing you should remember. The rest is very, very easy. In the next part, I'm going to show you how to operate with it. Now, a little bit about the lock. Uh, locks for Vans. Uh, mounted on Vans, obviously, in uh, UK. This is the key. Fully functional, six pins. Now, you will see that this uh, specific lock has this shield, probably to, you know, to keep the lock safe from uh, dirt and dust and stuff. It's very easy to, you know, to take a, to take a look inside of it. One thing to remember: on the locks we have, the pins are positioned all, uh, only on the right side. But sometimes on vans they might be reversed, and the pins are on the left side. It's very important to take a pick on which side, left or right, the pins are positioned. Obviously, you can see here that they're positioned on the right side. So, the moment you try to open it, this is where you will insert the tension. Now, the pins are clearly visible. They're positioned on the right side. And this is the space for the Tupolino. Tool. Uh, in the next part of the video, I'm gonna, of course, show you how to operate with it. Topolino works for Vans. Okay, so it's opening time. Topolino works for Vans. This is the demo lock I'm gonna be showing. Let's reset. Again, I repeat, you slide the button towards the black handle. Arrow here, arrow here, you insert it, you're able to see through the holes the pins. With the help of the reset tool, you push them down to the maximum. Extract the cap. Always check the pins, they should be fully aligned here horizontally. Now, as I have already advised you, some of the locks uh, can be positioned uh, the pins can be positioned on the left, on the right, so it's very important for you to take a look at the inside of the lock. So you know on which side to position first the tension, then the Topolino. Now this has a shield, so I must somehow find a way to insert it. I simply go from here and I start to turn it until I find its place. I don't know if you're able to see it from here but the pins are clearly positioned on the right side and that's enough for me to know my tool is 
reset slide i will slide the button up i will insert I will slide the button back towards the back handle and i start the procedure once up right neutral release this is where i apply tension not here but but here once up once down up right release down right release the faster you do it the faster the tupulino will unlock it let's remove it you cannot extract it without breaking it of course into this position which is the neutral one you close uh, you, you 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 push forward the, the slider hence the pins are now protected and you extract the tool this is uh, the coat you can of course compare it with the coat of the key very very clearly visible it's a perfect perfect match now good thing here i can extract it back in and if i'm careful and i do not shake the pins i should be able to keep my coat from this specific lock course it's fully functional no damage nothing so this was a video about Topolino locks for once and how to use it thank you for watching